Oh, hey guys, how are y'all? My name is Mr. H, and we will be talking about something very important today, guys. Money. Yes, 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 we will be talking about money today. So I'm gonna share my screen, and then we're gonna go ahead and get started. All righty. Let's do it, guys. How's everybody doing today? Is everybody doing okay? All right, so today we're gonna to be learning what is money? All right, so before we start, before we start, we have two rules. The first rule is gonna be treat others how you want to be treated. So if you would not like somebody to treat you mean, then don't be mean to others. It's all about being nice and respecting everyone. So that is gonna be our first rule, okay? And then our next rule is gonna be, whenever I say hocus pocus, you all will say, Everybody focus, everybody time to focus, okay? So I'm gonna say hocus pocus, and then you guys say everybody time to focus, okay? Let's try it. Hocus pocus. Good, 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 good. All right. All right, so what we're gonna be learning today is we're gonna play a five second game, a really fun game. And then we're gonna do a toy exchange where we're gonna talk about your favorite toy. And then we're gonna do a name game where you guys are gonna count up how many letters are in your first name. And we're gonna see who has the most money from the letters in their first name. And then we're gonna talk about what is money? What happens if we have no money? Do we need money? And then how can we grow with money? And then we're going to play a very fun Kahoot game. So let's do it, guys. All right. So our first game is I'm going to give you guys a topic. And then you guys have five seconds to tell me three things that relate to that topic. So we're gonna do a, a quick practice round and then we're gonna go live, okay? So the first topic I'm gonna choose is your favorite sport. So I'll go first and then we're gonna start with Mr. Lucas. That's what we're gonna start with first. So my favorite sport, we're gonna do tackling, running and passing. So my favorite sport is football. What about you, Lucas? Name three things about your favorite sport. Your favorite, favorite sports. Bike. Biking. Okay. Biking. biking. You like biking? Yep. Okay. Okay. What about you, Coco? Running. Running. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Jonathan, what about you? I like baseball. Ooh, what's your favorite thing about baseball? Because I like to hit the ball. Okay, okay, okay. So now we're gonna do another one. We're gonna talk about spending money. So name three things that you or your guardian has spent money on. What does your guardian spend money on? Does anybody know? Does anybody know what their guardian spends money on? What about you, Krista Bell? Do you know? I want, I just want to share my favorite sport. Okay, what is it? Basketball. Oh, basketball. Why do you like basketball? What's your favorite thing about it? 
because I get to do a ball into a hoop and I even have my own little game at home. Oh, that sounds fun. Who else wants to share? Does anybody else want to share? Okay, uh, Aditi, you want to share? Yeah. Okay. My favorite one is basketball. Oh, you like basketball too? Do you like to dribble or do you like to shoot? I like to shoot. Oh, okay, okay. So Santiago, I see you got your hand raised. What's your favorite sport? Um, well, it's not about the sport, but it's about what my guardian spends it on. Okay, talk to us. Well, well, usually for presents, two okay. things. Well, for presents, usually like Lego sets. Literally everything they give me is Lego sets. Oh. Uh, nah. The second thing, the second thing they mostly spend it on is let's say like supplies or sometimes my dad will try to get more cash. <laughs> and so what's your favorite thing about Lego sets? How much do those Lego sets cost? Do you know? Are they expensive? Do they cost a lot? Well, it depends on how big it is. Oh. Like sometimes, for example, I think... There are two like Minecraft sets. One's called the End Battle, and like that one wouldn't be as expensive because it's very small. But the Ender Dragon is a huge Lego set with a big like how what is it called again? Like the place like the where the story takes place usually setting like the, it has a big setting. It depends on the setting and how big the other things are. Okay. Okay. Well, let's move on to our next game. Let's see what we got this one. Oh, so this is good. So you can go grab your toy right here. You can go grab your Lego set. So we're going to take 30 seconds to grab your favorite toy and then come back to the screen. Ready, set, go. Go get your favorite toy. It doesn't even have to be a toy. Just your favorite thing in the house. Anything, anything. Okay, you getting it? You getting it? Okay, so now think about how much are you willing to sell that item for? How much are you willing to sell your favorite toy for? Think about it. Think about it. Take some time. You're going to sell it for $10? Are you going to sell it for $15? $20? $50? $100? Okay, let's, let's let everybody get back to the screen, and then we'll start asking how many people will, how much you will sell your uh, toy for. Okay. Let's go, Anson. How much are you going to sell your toy for? Um, um, $10 and, um, 59 cents. Oh, okay. Okay. That's some big money, man. What about you, Coco? How much are you going to sell your toy for? Mine was actually a talking store. So I think it's 100 <laughs> 100? He can't even talk. Oh, okay, okay. It's I'll tell you. And he sends five and ten. Oh, okay, okay, okay. What about you, Santiago? Well, I'm going to say it in like money. Basically, zero, no, one point. 10, 1.10, 1.010. Okay, so a dollar and 10 cents? Well, 100 cents and um, 110 cents. So that's how much cents. And let's say 110 coins or there's, I got, I got three of these very special coins that are 100 cents. Oh, that wow. Mean 100 so do you know that? A hundred and a hundred cents equals one dollar, so it's yeah. all about the value. So you can have either a hundred coins, or you can have one dollar, right? Yeah. Right. Let's see. Who else wants to share their favorite toy? How much are you gonna sell it for? 
That's Wika. Let's hear you. How much are you going to sell your toy for? Um, $10. Okay. Why is that $10? Why is it worth $10? Sell it to me. Because... Because it's pretty, because it's nice, or what is it? It's everything. Okay, it's worth everything. Okay, okay, okay. Who has a toy they want to share? Olivia, let's share one. How much are you going to sell that elephant for? That's my sister, my stuffy. Hello. How much are you going to sell her for? I'll pay her for one cent coin. Just one, one cent? cent coin. That's... Only one penny. One penny. Okay, just one penny. Now let's take one more. One more person. Who wants to share? Who wants to share? Lucas, Lucas, what you got for us? I'm going to sell it for... $16 and it's a race car. Oh, okay. So why is it worth $16? Why is that? Because it when you because when you open it up, there's there's little people inside from Roblox. Oh, so it has multiple purposes and multiple uses. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's real good, man. So now we're gonna play the name game. We're gonna switch games. We're gonna switch games, guys. So what we're going to do is this time, you're going to count up how many letters are in your first name. And each letter is going to be worth $1. Okay? Each letter is going to be worth $1. So everybody right now, count up how many letters are in your first name and figure out how much money do you have. Each Remember, each letter is worth $1. Okay? And then we're going to see who has the most. Okay, so we see Santiago has $8. Okay, okay. Let's see. Let, let everybody else get a chance to count it up. Okay, okay. Everybody know? All right, let's see. So who thinks they have the most money with the letters in their name? Who thinks they have the most money? Let's see. Let's see. How many? Santiago, let's see how many you have. Talk to it. Um, okay, then that means with cents, I would either have six, no, no, not six thousand, eight hundred or eight times ten tens. And with the cents, and then so I have eight dollars. And I think another friend showed eight. Letters okay. in their name, so they have the same amount. Okay, okay. What about Jonathan? Jonathan, how many letters in your name do you have that equals one dollar? I'm gonna go to my It's kind of hard to hear you, buddy. How many dollars do you have? Well, I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to spend it up for like 200 gazillion million. No, we're playing a new game. We're playing a new game. You're supposed to count up how many letters are in your first name and each letter is worth $1. Oh. So count up so the letters like... in your first name and come back to us, okay? Okay. First right. letter Let's is see. J. Who else? Who else? Christabel, how many how many letters do you have in your name? How much money do you have? We can't hear you, Christabel. Uh, nine. I think I have nine letters in my name. Uh oh, we think I think Christabel has the most money. You got nine dollars. I, I like have a lot of money in my piggy bank. Okay, what about Emily? What about Emily? How many? How much money do you have, Miss Emily? I have five letters in my name. 
Okay, so how much money is that? If each letter is worth one dollar? Five dollars. Okay, you got five dollars. So what can you buy with five dollars? What do you think? You don't know? You could buy some candy. Yep, you could buy a hair bow. A lot of different things you could buy. What about Nita? How many, how many, uh, how much money do you have, Nita? Mm, five, five letters in my name. First letter is N. Okay, okay. So how much money, so you have $5. So what can you buy with $5? What do you think? Um, dinner. Yeah, that's true. You go to Wendy's, get a four for four. from outside, yep. like. <laughs> food from outside yep yep that's true that's and, true all right so let's move on and so now we're going to talk about what is money so who thinks money is important if you think money is important grab your ear like this okay and if you don't think money is important just sit there like this all right so let me see grab your ear like this if money is important and if it's not important, just sit there like this. All right, let's see, let's see. Sebastian, I see you grabbing your ear, man. Tell me why money, why you think money is important, man? Why do you think money is important, Sebastian? Do you wanna talk? Yes, okay. I think it's important so you can pay houses. Yes, yes. Being able to pay for your house is one of the best things that money can do because it keeps you safe in a house. That's true. That's true. So let's see. Okay, I see you grabbing your ear, Emily. Talk to us. Why is money important? So that you can buy things. Yes, because things cost money, right? Uh-huh. Yeah. If yep, you didn't have any money, then you won't be able, then you wouldn't have anything. That's true. And it would be, it, you have no clothes on your body. You'd be cold. And yeah, that's true. Who else? Who else is grabbing their ear and thinks money is important? You grabbing your ear, Lucas? Yeah, yeah. Let me hear you, man. Why is money important? So you can buy things like a house, shelter, clothes, toys. Oh, yep, you're right, you're right, you're right. Food, everything. Yes, sir, 100%, because money is basically a tool that you use to exchange for things you want or things that you need. So you guys had your toys, and if you were selling your toys for $10, and I had $10, then I could buy your toy, you get $10, and I get your toy, right? Exactly, that's how money works. You use it to exchange for things that you want or that you need. And also money is what provides us with our basic needs, the things that we need, like food. Everybody needs food. Hold on. What's your guys' favorite food? Who has something? If you have something to say, let me let me see you pull your ear like this. What's your favorite food? Nita, what's your favorite food? Dosa. Okay, so how much, and that costs money, right? Uh, it costs, it costs um, million. Oh, a million, that's some expensive food. If you didn't have money, you couldn't buy that, so you wouldn't be able to eat it. So you gotta have, make sure you have some money. So what about you, Anson? What's your favorite food? Um, chocolate cake and gummy bear and some vegetables and some fruits. Okay, okay, yep, yep. That's and I, mean, true. I, I, I super love his carrots. They help our eyes. They do. I love carrots too. Yep, yep. What about you, Coco? What's your favorite food? Cherry. You say carrots? Cherry. I always oh. answer cherry if you somebody said uh, what food I love. 
Okay, okay, I like them too. Yep, and it all takes money to buy those different foods that you guys like. So like I said, money provides us with things that we need like food, housing, you know, we, we gotta pay for our houses like uh, someone said earlier, clothing, the clothes on your body, right? Transportation, you have to get to school, you have to get to the park, get to different fun places, and that takes a car or a bike or any type of transportation. So who all thinks we need money? Do we need money? What do you think? What do you think? Let me pull your ear if we need money. If we don't need money, just sit like this with the sad face. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see. What about Sh Shira? Shira, do we need money? Hey, what about Henry? Henry, do we need money? We can't hear you, Mr. Henry. So do you think we need money, Mr. Henry? Yeah. Why is that? Why do you think we need money, Henry? To buy things that we need. I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. What'd you say, buddy? To buy things that we need. To try things? Okay. What about Sienna and Tyler? Do we need money, Sienna and Tyler? Yes. Okay. Why is that? Why do you think we need money? For, for food and mm -hmm. for, for, for That's true. What about, so you said food. Okay, Sienna. What about Tyler? Tyler, what do we need money for? And a house. Yep, that's true, man. That's true. Yep, so we need money because money keeps us safe and it keeps us secure. It keeps us in the house. It keeps us with money. It keeps us with food to eat. So money is just very important because it provides us with the basic needs. And as you said earlier, stuff costs money. So we need money to pay for the different things that we need in our lives. Exactly. You guys are all right. So now let's talk about what happens if we don't have any money? What do you guys think? Is that a, what do you guys think if we don't have any money? Let's see, let's see, let's see. What about Jayola? Jayola, you there? Yes, um, probably to We're doing something important. Oh, okay, no worries, no worries, it's okay. What about Emily? What happens if we don't have any money, Emily? What do you think? Um, we wouldn't be able to buy anything and we wouldn't have any stuff. Yep, that's true, that's true. Like, like what's your favorite fun, what's your favorite thing to do for fun? Um, I know you have something you like to do for fun. Play with my mom and dad. Okay, that is daddy. fun, that is fun. So that's something that's free, so that's good. Keep doing that. <laughs> what about you, um, uh, let's see, Anson, I see you got your hand raised. What about you, what's your favorite thing to do for fun? Um, play with my dad and Play my games at Clown Princess Zombie with my dad. Okay. So did you know that game that you have cost money? Did you know that? Oh, I know some of the games cost money and Fitch Dog. Fitch Dog and Clown Princess Zombie, that's my two favorite games to play with my dad. Yep, yep. And you got to have money to play those and fun games. Let's see. Let's take one more person. That's uh, Sebastian. What you got for us? What's your favorite fun thing to do? You're saying if you don't have money, and my favorite thing. 
Okay, let's hear it. If you don't have money, then you will, then you can't play. And you also can't go outside, and you can't and and get dressed. But mm -hmm. if and my favorite thing is, and now I'm gonna tell you my favorite food. My favorite food is hot plates. And then my favorite thing to do is play. Okay, okay. Play yeah, with man. friends. All right, we'll take one more, one more. Sebastian, what's your favorite fun thing to do? And then what do you think happens if we don't have money? Uh, Santiago, sorry. Uh, not, not Sebastian, I'm sorry. S Santiago. Well... Three things. First, did you know Sebastian was my brother? Really? Yeah, he is my brother. Oh, wow. I didn't even know. Is he the little brother or the big brother? Little. Okay, okay. Um, and if we didn't have money, like, we would have to get things by ourselves. We wouldn't have things if we didn't know how to find them but like if mm -hmm. we try to find them we would have to get them for ourselves instead and make it easier by getting money yep yep that's true that's true and there's certain ways that we can get money so let's think about how can money grow how can you increase the money that you have what do you guys think does anybody have, have an answer to that how can we make money does anybody know does anybody know how we can make money? Lucas Santa. How can we make money? Um, you could sell you could sell stuff or make a or get a job or be an entrepreneur. Good job. Look, getting a job. Good job, man. That was really good. That's one thing you can do to get money or to grow your money is getting a job and being helpful being helpful to your parents around the house, being helpful to your neighbors. You know, sometimes when you help people and you and you allow them to do something easier in their lives, they might pay you for it. So that's very good, that's very good. Who else has a way that you can make money? Does anybody else know any, any ways you can make money? Let's see, let's see. Who, who knows how they can make money? Okay, I see uh, Shira. Shira, you know how to make money? Okay, I can't hear her. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Coco, how do you make money? And how you need to learn more. If mm. you work, if you work more and learn more, somebody will give you money. Or you uh, you water the tree, somebody will give you money. Yep, that's so true. That's so true. Being creative and learning more. That's 100% true. Whenever you create and you help people, they will pay you for it because you're helping them. That's great. That's great. So let's do one more. One more person. Tell us how we can make some money. Anybody know how we can make some money? Let's see. Lucas, you got your, you know how we can make some money, Lucas? Mm, being good. Being good, yep, yep. That could be some a good way to make money. I like it, I like it, I like it. So another way to make money is by time. When you save money for a long period of time, your money grows. So that's why it's so good to get into habit of saving money early. So we all need to be saving our money and not just spending it on anything. We need to be saving our money to watch it grow and get big, right? Yeah. All right, so now we're gonna play our fun Kahoot game. So I have a few rules for you, so I need you guys to listen up, okay? So we're gonna play this fun game, and then you guys are going to tell me the red button is gonna be, you're gonna touch your ear. The yellow button, means you're gonna to touch your nose. But first, before we get into that, what's gonna be our team name? Piggy bank? Money? What do you guys think? What, what we should do? 
The Money Squad, what do you guys think? Who has a team name for us? All right, let's hear yours, Coco. Coyote. 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 Okay, okay. Lucas, you got one for us? Let's hear it. Um, the Super Money Squad. Oh, I like that one because we're talking about money. So I like that one. Let's do that one. Super Money Squad. Super Money Squad. Oh, it's too big. Let's say, let's just do Money Squad, okay? Is that okay? Okay, let's just do that. Boom. Okay, so now they're going to ask us some questions. So touch your ear if you want red. Yellow, touch your nose. Green, cover your mouth. And blue, put your elbow right here. All right, so read the question. Which of those things cost money? Red if it's touch your ear. Green if it's cover your mouth. Blue, put your elbow on the screen. And then yellow, touch your nose. What do we think? What do we think? Elbow, okay, okay. Oh, so it was it was the green. It was the green. We got to cover our mouths with this one. All right, let's see what we get next. All right, so true or false? If it's true, go like this. If it's false, go like this. Is it true or is it false? What you got? True, false, false. True. Let's go with, I see more true. Hey, we got it. We got it, guys. Good job. Good job. It was true. All right, let's move up. Let's move up the board. Let's move up. All right, another true, another true or false? True or false? What is it? True or false? What do we see? Let me see everybody. Let me see everybody. True or false? True or false? True? False. All right. I see. All right. Saving money is a good idea. Good job, guys. All right. Let's see if we moved up. Okay. We're in fourth. Let's get to first place, right? We got to win. We got to win. All right, so how much does a candy bar cost? What do you guys think? If it's red, pull your ear. If it's yellow, touch your nose. If it's green, cover your mouth. Blue, put your elbow in there. What do you guys think? You think it's green? Oh, it was $1. It was yellow. Ah. Yeah, we missed that one, guys. All right, so which of these things cost money? Red, touch your ear. Yellow, touch your nose. Blue, put your elbow in the screen like this. Okay, I see your nose. What? Oh, man, we got it wrong. It's okay. We still got time to come back, guys. Which of these things cost money? So let's do red, yellow, or blue. Okay. What y'all think? Yellow or blue? Yellow or blue? Yellow. Hey, we got it. Good job, guys. Let's see where we're at. All right. We're only a little bit from third place. Let's get into third place. Is money important or is money not important? So if money is important, do like a T for true. If money is not important, thumbs down. I see those trues. I see those trues. Hey, we got it. We got it. 
Good job. I think we're in third place. Let's see if we get third. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, man. I don't think we got it this time, guys. Yeah, better luck next time. We're going to do it next time, okay? Yeah, we're going to get them next time. We got fourth place. That's not bad, though, guys. Still pretty good. Still pretty good. So now let's go back to our game. Yep, so now for our action items of the day. Turn that off, first of all. And for our action items of the day, guys, we need you guys to go talk to your parents and download the Planet app. And after you download the Planet app, explain to your guardians, you explain to your guardian what money is. Tell them what money is. Tell them what money can buy and then ask your guardian, how do they make money? Okay. So talk with your parents. Okay. You got something, Coco? Let's hear. I got some money. Oh, yes. How much is that? Can, can you count it for us? Let's see how much that is. Yep. So when you guys get off, like I said, we need you to explain to your guardian what money is, okay? Make sure you guys do that and then ask them, how do they make money? And then talk about money, okay? Because this is something that we can talk about. It's nothing to be scared of. Money is a positive thing if you can make it a positive thing. It is a tool that provides us with our basic needs like a house, the clothes that we like to wear, the fun things we like to do, if we don't have money, it will be really hard to do those things, okay? All right, so let's hear, let's hear from you guys, and then we're going to start logging off, okay? So Anson, let's hear. You got something for us, man? My favorite sport is Beyblades. Is Beyblades? That's a spinner contest that we was talking about. Okay, I didn't know Bed Blades was a sport, but I guess so. Yeah, okay. that was a lot. It was just a movie, but like, they, they are selling like Bay Blades, like Bays and other, and it has spinners. It all, oh. some people, some some Play Store was selling now because mm -hmm. then you can play Bay Blade now. Do they cost a lot of money? Um, I, I think so. Oh, wow. So that means you got to save up money to get it, right? Yeah. Yep. But you don't save up just the amount of money. $10 and, and uh, $99, uh, 99 cents. Okay. So what you do is you save up $20 and then you go spend $10 because you don't want to save $10 and spend $10, right? Because that leaves you with what? $0. Yep, exactly. So save $20 and then go buy your toy for $10 so you can still have $10 left over, right? Exactly. Sebastian, Santiago, you got anything for us? Let's hear you, Santiago. I have a treasure chest full of necklaces and a lot of things. My grandma gave me the treasure chest for Christmas well, one time, like, I think two years ago on Christmas, no, no, like, I think either four or three years ago for Christmas, I got a treasure chest, and she gave me some of her necklaces, and the necklaces I got for, I think, like, at a Halloween birthday party, and then mm -hmm. some other, like, toys I got, and I still had a bunch of coins, and then... Do you know that I used some money from there to trick my brother that I was a leprechaun, giving him a pot of gold by making a pot shaped thing that was about a leprechaun pot shaped size mm -hmm. and put some money in it. And then he thought it was from a leprechaun because I automatically just snuck it to there without him noticing me. And then um, he thought it was a leprechaun. And then by the end of that day, I did that. Uh -huh. it, 
I revealed that it was me, but mainly he didn't know it. And then, um, also, um, I also have a lot of dollars, and my tooth fairy usually, like, gives me about, like, a pack full of, like, five dollars. Okay, wow. Like, wow. every time I lose a tooth. And I already... Yep, so thanks, thanks guys. I really appreciate you. And I hope you learned what money is, right? Because we all know that money is important, correct? Definitely, definitely. So thank you guys for tuning in. I hope to see you all next Monday, right? Yeah, we're gonna be learning some really cool things next Monday. So definitely tune, come back and, and, and join us. And thank you for coming.